explaining right now what is calibration right now. The calibration means uh, you have to calibrate each and every of these probes. I have told you there are three different types of probes here, normal, the other thing. So uh, you cannot use this any probe. Uh, suddenly, if, if I am giving you a test material uh, right now, so you cannot use this uh, any of the probe to inspect that particular test material at the moment. So before using this uh, these probes on that particular test material, you have to calibrate it. Which means you have to calibrate your normal probe connected to your equipment or TR probe connected to your equipment or any probe connected to your equipment. So we will study right now how to calibrate it. Okay, so calibration means you have to undergo this uh, equipment which is connected to any of these probes either normal or TR or anti probe. You have to undergo through a series of steps. So what I am going to say is uh, you already know what will happen after doing all this after undergoing through all these steps. You know the final result actually. Uh, so we are checking right now that uh, we are getting that uh, proper result or not. Okay. I know what will happen if I do calibration. Okay. I know what what is the result it will give after calibration. So what I am going to check it right now that whether if I am getting the same result or not. If you are not getting that particular result means your equipment is not calibrated or your equipment has got some serious problem you have to change your equipment. So this is what we are going to check right now. So there are four different steps for calibration. The first one is uh, horizontal linearity, second was vertical linearity, third is sensitivity, and fourth is resolution. These are the four steps we have to undergo uh, for calibration of normal or TR probe. So these steps are only used for calibrating your either your normal probe or TR probe.